Welcome to our channel. The biggest miracle has happened. You have arrived into this world from another place and instantly all of your memories have been erased. So you don't remember who you are, where you came from, and you don't know where you're going after your physical heart will stop beating. My name's Sam and I've actually been to the other side. When I returned to this planet, all of my memories were intact. They were not erased. So I was given a great gift that I'm now trying to share with the rest of the world to help you become more fulfilled, to become more happy. So you will know how to handle your life. You'll be able to decipher the meaning and purpose of your life on this planet, in this three-dimensional world. So, what is it that determines or predetermines your path? See, your name is meaningless. The name that's written in your passport on your driver's license is absolutely a useless collection of letters and sounds when you pronounce it. Example, if you were born in a different country from your original birthplace, you would be given a totally different name. Or if you were stolen, at the time of your birth and raised by different parents, they would give you a totally different name. Do you see my point? So your name is completely irrelevant in the grand scheme of things. The brainwashing or indoctrination that you were given by society, by your parents, by your friends, by your surroundings, that's what truly encoded you, programmed you to become who you are today. And that's what we're going to tackle. We're going to give you a new identity, a new name, a new direction in life. I will share with you everything that I've learned on the other side, which is a tremendous, tremendous gift that I was given. You see, when we come into this world, the programming begins from society and parents and so on and so forth, from the school and than the college university and it leads us nowhere dead end because it's all false we're given incomplete or false information about who we are so I'm here to bring you the truth I'm here to give you the good news the evangelion which is the Greek word for the good news so if you follow the Bible if you're a Christian or if you follow the Quran if you're a Muslim or if you like to read the Book of the Dead if you're a Buddhist. Welcome to our family here where you learn the truth. You see, the most important, the trifecta in our life is spirituality, health, and our finances. I'm going to share with you the secrets, how you will be, be able to master all three naturally, effortlessly. As you know, I've been given some tremendous information on the other side, which you're going to learn from me. For the past 28 years, I've been running a family office. A family office is essentially a hedge fund that manages top echelon of society's assets, taxes, and uh, legal matters. So you will learn the secrets of the ultra-wealthy, how to create wealth, how to leave a legacy for your children, and as far as health goes, well, I have personally, uh, I'm a witness to how to improve one's health. I have lost 40 pounds within 90 days on an organic diet by eating an organic fruit every morning on an empty stomach to kickstart my metabolism. And then do a little calisthenics or a little exercise in the morning or play tennis or swim or run or whatever, whatever you like to do. But you must be active and then I will raise your awareness so you will reestablish your connection with Mother Nature, with the trees, with animals, and eventually with God by getting on the frequency of God. 
So if Jesus was around today, he would use this type of a language. He would tell you the frequency of God. 2,000 years ago, most people didn't know what that means. You see, the frequency of God is the only way how we could reach God in this physical world because God is spirit. We can't touch Him. We cannot reach out and touch Him. The only way to reach God is through our thoughts, through our prayers, through a meditative approach, which I'm going to teach you. That's right. It's not very complicated for you to be able to learn how to walk on water, how to heal the sick, how to cast out demons, and even how to raise people from the dead. That's right. That's what Jesus said. And He said, I'm going, and uh, after I go, I'll send you a helper, and you'll do greater things, even greater than He did, He said. And so, you see, it's not very complicated. It's not very complicated once you get on the frequency of God. And if you recall, in the Bible, there's a, a scene where He transformed in front of His disciples on Mount Tabor, when He became brighter than the sun. See, that's what I'm going to teach you, how to get to that level, because this is our ultimate, ultimate destiny on earth, is how to transfigure and, and shine like the sun, even brighter than the sun, because that's what, who we are. We are the sparks of God's love. God is love. Agape love. Agape is a Greek term, but biblical term, which means the highest form of divine, unconditional love of God that little children usually possess in more abundance than we do, we the adults. This is why Jesus said, forbid them not to come to me, for such is the kingdom of heaven. He was referring to little children. And he also said, unless you become like these little children, you will by no means be able to enter the kingdom of God. It is so true, so true. What he meant by that is by being on the frequency of God, not so much to become you know, naive little children like children are, and they are naive and they're pure. But what he meant is children are on the frequency of God. That's what we need to do as adults. So if your ex-wife or your ex-husband is trying to use your children as a bargaining chip in a divorce situation, you won't get angry, you won't get upset, you won't be, you will be able to manage that properly. See, anger is the first sign of that you're on the leash of the devil who whispers into your ears, the shaitan. You know, the Iblis. Iblis is the Arabic word for the biblical equivalent of Lucifer, which is the brightest, most glorious, most powerful and beautiful angel ever created by God. He became very proud and he was cast down from heaven onto earth. This is a prison here. We used to have a garden, we no longer have it. You know, the Garden of Eden, where Adam and Eve were created, in modern terms, your know, biological laboratory where they were biologically created. But that's a different story for a different conversation. I'm so glad to see you on our channel. Welcome to our Agape family. And I hope that one day, one day you will very soon create your own channel and spread this word of Evangelion or the good news with other people, how to get on the frequency of God, how to take care of your health, how to take care of your finances. It's not very complicated and I'll be able to I'd be happy to share that with you, all the secrets that I've learned and accumulated over the years. To you and to all those kind people who are the salt of the earth. So on this note, again, I'm very happy you found us through providential mystery of God, because God works in mysterious ways. So welcome to our family. God bless you. And I hope to talk to you soon again, God willing.